What is the story with Friday the 13th and tattoos? Well, it started in, well, he knows it better. Friday the 13th started in Texas at Elm Street. But the $13 tattoo special was created at Elm Street from what I was told and from what I've, you know, gathered. And it's expanded to uh, many, many hundreds of shops, thousands probably at this point, all over the world, but mostly all over America. Well, the shop tattoos for 24 hours straight on Friday the 13th, starting at midnight the morning of, until the midnight of the night, you know what I mean? It's 11.59, whatever. So it's, it's, a, it's a 24 hour thing. The majority of the tattoos are probably the size of a quarter, you know? Maybe smaller, right around that size, they have the number 13 in them. Maybe the state outline of Texas with a 13. And most of the tattoos are black or black and red. Like they don't do a whole lot of color. And they're, they're lined up down the street all day. Like starting at midnight that morning, they are tattooing nonstop all day. Until until it's over, and they'll usually just keep tattooing until everyone's taken care of. Thirteen dollars. So there's tattoos. no good luck, bad luck. Like it's bad luck if you go into a tattoo shop on Friday the thirteenth and you don't get a thirteen tattoo. That's the way I heard it. That's bad luck. <laughs> I have to get yeah, one get today now. Yeah, you just walk into a shop. Dude, you're just dying to tattoo. Anyway. That's all it is. That's all it is. <laughs> <laughs> Raul, you brought your pop in. To sure did. I've uh, been waiting to do this for a while. Well, so we've been planning to get a, a matching like navel tattoo for almost a year now. Texted him, like, hey, let's get a shell back together. We're both trusty shell backs, so why not? So both of you are in the Navy right now? Yes. How yeah. many years for dad? 20. 20 years. How many years are you in? Uh, I'll be five in November. Did you push him to go in the Navy? Yeah, he was my last for the month. I was a recruiter. Really? Yeah. Are you shitting me? Are you shitting yeah. me? Yeah, it wasn't the last of the month, but that's the joke. <laughs> that I need you. I need you for this month so we can make it. So I can make my quota. So make, my, make it. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> so that's our joke, but that's not the reason why he wanted to join, and I just happened to be a recruiter at the time, so uh, re-enlisted me as well. My brother is actually my little brother. He's 18. He's about to come in too. Yeah, about to be a family of sailors. Family of sailors. Yeah. No shit. Yeah. And you guys came in and got the shell back together. Sure did. When did you really get the shell back though? How many years uh, ago? 2003. But you waited and came in with and your son and got it. Waited and waited and waited. Talked about it and made it happen. So. What'd you think? What do you think of the tattoo? Oh, it's awesome. Yeah? Oh yeah, awesome. That's the easiest tattoo I've got. It's awesome. Right I'm on. I'm again, so. So he started filling in and you're at half sleeve now? Yeah, just about. He left a few spots open just in case. I'm super happy. I've been waiting to get the half sleeve done forever. I've, I've wanted a sleeve for years now, but I didn't know what I wanted. And I was walking walking down gas lamp one drunk night. I saw this place, I was like, oh hell yeah. This is the place right here. And you've been coming back ever since. Two weeks, every two weeks, twice yeah. a month. Yeah, is the Friday the 13th uh, a thing in Argentina? It is. I think it's popular everywhere now. That's true. You've traveled everywhere. You've seen it before. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it is. In one, every one time ago in Germany, the guy, the owner for the show, do the Friday 13, and the, we do like a, I do uh, 75 tattoos. No shit. Yeah. To, to 10 o'clock till 
Till midnight. Uh, no, eight o'clock or something like that. No shit. See, it's like like race. Really simple tattoos, only lines, black shading, maybe red. Friday the 13th. Is that, is that a thing in England too? I Getting mean, a yeah. tattoo on Friday the 13th? Yeah, it's just the same as here, it's just begrudged to do it, you know what I mean? Like, you don't really want to do it. <laughs> Wait, have you done it though? Yeah. Have you sat and powered through a bunch of Of 13s? course, everyone's done it. Everyone's done it a couple times, you know? Yeah, I feel yeah, like yeah. every tattoo has been round the block once or twice has definitely done the Friday the 13th. Yeah. <laughs> That it was just like a bee sting. Like a bee sting, not that bad. Yeah. <laughs> was this your first tattoo from Buddy? No, this is my second tattoo from Buddy. It's your second tattoo yeah. from Buddy. Yeah. What do you think of this one? I love it. Like, I think uh, he did a great job with all the detail and stuff. The first one he did was great too. So definitely go see Buddy if you're gonna come get a tattoo here, dude. He did it like an hour. <laughs> took him an hour to do it. So easy. What about the other one? How long did that take? I think the other one took like roughly the same time, maybe like an hour and a half. Not sure. So it was like in and out super fast. Yeah. Did I hear you right? You're doing the full leg sleep? I am. I'm starting to do the full leg sleep with Buddy. So I'm really excited to keep going and get my next one. Dude, how many tattoos have you done today? Nah, not enough. But seriously, what are you at? You're at like six today? I don't know. Like, not that many really, but just like big ones. You're not even going to have the energy to give away a shirt or to do a... Hey, this is my new shirt, blah, blah, blah. Hey, this is my new shirt. Come buy one, don't be a cheapskate, I need money. <laughs> nappies. <laughs> Come pay me, please. Why do you need to buy nappies? Got a little baby buddy coming, don't I? How many, how many months till uh, baby love is coming? Four months. Four months. You all know Buddy's having a child, right? Yeah. Yay. Zach was telling me about like dad dick like once you have kids like your dick like looks different it's like it like hangs lower it's like rounder at the top like because it knows it's like done its job you know it's like proven its worth you know it's like it's it has like a level of arrogance to it you know isn't that fucking jokes i thought that was so funny i thought that was so funny man. He has done your whole right arm. Yeah. And then today he had to fix. So uh, yeah, fix a uh, fix a mistake. <laughs> what happened? Give me the scoop. I kind of got hyped by uh, a couple of friends, and we just went and did it. And it was a bad idea. You and didn't I, like as it. As soon afterwards. as it was done, the guy was like, "Are you happy?" And I'm like, "Not really. It, it was nothing like we had talked about or like what we did." Really? Yeah. So I was just like, "Yeah, don't worry about it. I'll uh, I'll take care of it." Wow. So, well, and because you're used to getting a fill tattoo where it, you walk away. Exactly. Satisfied and like, man, it's badass. 
So this is what happens, and then you have to pay double for and a then, tattoo. Yeah, double it up, yeah. <laughs> but lesson, what do you think now? Lesson learned, though. It looks awesome. It's, it's perfect. And you won't stray away from Phil anymore? Hey, no, can't. No, at, least get a Phil, at least get a Phil recommendation, right? Yeah. <laughs> How was England? It was good, man. It was good. I forgot those fucking interviews, man. <laughs> fucking hell. I didn't miss that, mate. Ah, you fucker. But you came back with new shirts. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Right. Oh, yeah. Stand up. Let me see that. 